really wanted to do a video about faith and keeping it. So a couple of days ago I did a video called I Fucked Up in which I spoke about the fact that even though I planned for ages to do My Life Your Hands because I wasn't getting the response I wanted, I was thinking about quitting it and I was avoiding doing my videos and I was avoiding doing my work. I woke up this morning in Takare in Brazil. I was in my hostel and one of my friends I met here that I've been traveling with said to me that she just got a text message from one of her friends in London saying that your friend you're traveling with is on the homepage of the Daily Mail online. And we were like, what friend? And then we suddenly realized that she was talking about me. I did an interview a couple of weeks ago with a press agency and I had no idea where it was gonna end up and it turned out being the lead story on the homepage of the Daily Mail. I sat there, I looked around at the beautiful scenery as I sat eating my breakfast in the hostel and all I could think to myself was about faith and was thank you God. Now whether God for you is the universe, is the source, is spirit, is Allah, is Buddha, or something else, it really doesn't matter. But being able to keep faith in something, to know that what you want is gonna happen and will happen, but in its time, in its own time. And understanding that what is meant for you is meant for you. You can't change it, you have to go with the flow, you have to roll with the punches, that's the ups, the downs, the good, the bad. I even think that about the death of my mum and my sister. Of course, I wish more than anything that they could be here to share my life with me, but they're not. So I've chosen to view that as a sign that that is what was meant for me so that hopefully by me going through that it means that I will be able to help other people in similar situations to make the most of their life and to not let grief consume them. So my message today is whatever you want in life, whatever you're working hard for, whatever you think you need, have faith that it is going to come your way. It might not happen now, it might not happen in a week, it might not happen in a month, it might not happen in a year. But you have to hold the faith that it is going to happen. Because trust me, like today when I woke up, it was just a normal day. And out of nowhere, bam, that happened. And then something else happened. And then something else happened. And something else happened. And that has just reinstalled in me the fact that I must keep the faith. I continue to pray every morning. I continue to pray every evening for the things that I want. Mostly that's just to help other people. And I ask God to give me the ability to be able to do that, to give me the people, the situations, and the opportunities to be able to reach people and to be able to help them with their lives. So remember, make sure that you keep the faith. And while you're here, why not subscribe to my channel, visit my website, mylifeyourhands.com, where you can vote for what I do next. And you can also suggest things for me to do. Why not? Give it a shot.